I just want you to know that your perfumes will not save you. Your perfumes will not save you. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Bella and this is Bella's Perfume Diaries. If this is your first time of stumbling on this channel, Perfume Diaries is a series where we talk about perfumes, a sprinkle of beauty and lifestyle. So if this is the kind of content you like, please click that subscribe button and join the family. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Thank you for tuning in once again. On this episode, I'm going to be talking about fragrance hacks. And I'm going to be telling you the reason why your perfumes are not enough. Some people just feel like if I just get a good, long-lasting, crazy projecting fragrance, I am good to go. Just because people like shortcuts. So by the end of this video, I'm going to be showing you the fastest way to smell amazing from the strand of your hair to your feet. So without wasting much time, let's jump right into the video. The first one is fragrance hacks for your hair i just want to put this disclaimer out there these fragrance hacks would only work if you have a good personal hygiene the first thing you need to do is wash your hair frequently for ladies i know guys wash their hair every day but for ladies not necessarily every day maybe once a week or twice a week because we sweat a lot on our hair if you're the kind of person that sweats even more on your hair you need to increase the number of times you wash your hair. If you have froze, if you use wigs, if you keep short uh, low cuts, this hack will definitely work for you. So get a brush and get a perfume or a body mist, something that you would love your hair to smell like. Spray on the brush. I see a lot of people spray perfume on their hair. It's not so healthy. It would be better for you to spray on the hair brush you're going to use to brush your hair before you brush it this is a very crazy hack because it works like magic your hair is said to retain fragrances longer than any part of your body so by the time you do that every twist and turn you make the fragrance just blows through and you know just makes that part smell fresh and clean all day the second part we are going to is your mouth i'm not really going to dwell so much on this but because i mean this is something that everybody knows already but in this hack i'm going to tell you the reason why most people have bad breath people focus more on their teeth but what makes you have bad breath is your tongue most of the times brushing your tongue is not just enough you need to scrape you need to tongue scrape so that's one hack that I just thought to throw in for this. Obviously, you know that you're supposed to be brushing your teeth twice a day. You should always have mint in your bag. You can just throw in mint in your mouth just to keep your mouth smelling fresh all day. So we are going to go to fragrance hacks for the skin. The thing is, you have to prepare the foundation. You cannot spray perfume on dirty body. The, the foundation is your body. You have to start from the beginning. You cannot skip the process. You use scented washes to wash your skin and then use scented lotions. By the time you moisturize with scented lotion, your skin is now ready to take in whatever you pour on it. Then you now pour in your body mist. I feel that people know these things, but they just don't, they're not just intentional about it. By the time you prepare the skin and spray your body mist and then spray your perfume where is that body odor coming from where is that bad smell coming from you just finished cooking frying fish frying this one frying that one and then next thing you're entering the room you now spray perfume on that you spray perfume on a fish what do you expect to come out just imagine mixing perfume inside fish you cannot cover up bad hygiene with perfume it just doesn't work that way so you have to be intentional about your skin and intentional about preparing your skin for your perfumes another very important part is your armpits I watched a very thorough video by one of my favorite youtubers Fumi DVF or something like that like she was very thorough she even brought out the soap and the sponge and was scrubbing it to show you how it was done she was so thorough in that video i'm going to drop the link of the video 
below please you guys need to watch that video it was so thorough for if you are having issues with you know smelling pits or like your your pits smell funny before the end of the day and you have just been struggling with it please watch that video it's going to be very very helpful if possible subscribe to her channel because she's so helpful with things like this with a feminine hygiene with hygiene in general and she's so thorough with her videos i'm not going to talk so much about your armpits just go and watch that one the next one we'll be talking about is your clothes so after you finish you know preparing your skin taking care of your skin and everything and then you wear dirty clothes what's now the essence of doing all those other things like you have defeated the purpose so for your clothes always always be choosy about your detergents i know you you might think that you, i'm being vain or anything but it helps use detergents that smell good like really good it really helps your clothes of course you definitely find the one that forms and lathers and whatever you want from a detergent but make sure that it smells good if you have others you can recommend in the comment section very importantly sun dry like sun dry your clothes and make sure they are dried properly so it doesn't feel like they are moist because when they are moist they start bringing up some kind of funny smell so make sure they are dried properly last one i'll be talking about is your feet so it is very important to keep your feet clean obviously you know this already but the hack i'm going to be giving for your feet is it's very important for you to always sun dry your shoes especially you know covered shoes you sun dry them when you bring them in put a tea bag inside your shoes if it's for shoes that you don't wear often you can get a cotton pad or cotton wool put like drops of oils on the cotton pad and then put it in your shoes this hack also helps your wardrobes your um drawers you can do this as well so this hack helps to make your space smell clean and fresh all day so making your house smell clean and fresh all day invest in diffusers candles you know most people use incense incense helps as well but not everybody likes the smell of incense you can get the one that is bearable for people so when people enter your house you don't feel like it's the smell is being so overpowering on them these hacks are extremely important for us to implement every day because your perfumes will not save you so these are the few hacks that i have at the moment if you have more hacks please drop them in the comment section i'm sure there's somebody that will go through my comment section and see it and find it helpful to them if this video was helpful to you please drop a comment also like this video as well subscribe to this channel if you haven't i mean you can't just come and be enjoying these things and you are not subscribed to my channel click that subscribe button and join the family thank you guys for tuning into bella's perfume diaries i'll see you on my next episode bye